to him on the way. Line hard, but foul. Well out in front of the breaking ball there for a strike. Got him to chase after the curveball below the zone there. That was a really nice pitch, and it can be a really tough one to lay off of as a hitter. And Goldschmidt able to put the squeeze on it here. You're one away. Three. Tyler Flowers will get the call here as he'll hit for the pitcher. Tyler Flowers. Shot back up the middle. That gets down, and he's got himself a base hit. The right field, the 13. And here's Ronald Acuna Jr. now. As the first pitch to him is in there for a called strike one. A swinging strike, and now it's 0-2. Breaking ball that time that misses out of the zone. Good swing on a tough pitch, and he'll stick around to see another one. Ready with another two strike offering. In the dirt here, but it won't skip away far enough for the runner to advance. Popped him up. Goldschmidt moving to his left, and that's the second out of the inning. Digging in once again, Ozzy Albies. There are two gone, and the possible go ahead run at first. Here's the first pitch. Hey. Two out with the possible go-ahead run at first. Waved at and missed, and he's behind 0-2. The count doesn't mean much to this batter. He's all in. He's not concerned with striking out, so he's going to get his A swing off. Fouled away. Ready with another two-strike offering. Goal. And he strikes him out here for out number three. So after a scoreless top half, they'll have a chance to win it here in the bottom half. Darren O'Day comes on to start the home tenth, and he's just hoping to get this one into the eleventh inning. Ready for the bottom of the tenth here, and set to go as the switch hitting outfielder, Tommy Edmond. No left fielder, Tommy Edmond. He's ready. Here's the first offering. Ball at the third. The 1 0 -oh. is looked at for the first strike. Mine to the right side. But this is right at him in right field as he hardly has to move to take it in for the first out. And that'll bring up the former top prospect, Harrison Bader. No hits in three tries so far. He struck out once. He's ready. Here's the first offering. Breaking ball drops right in the chute for a strike. Hey, these mechanics ain't out of the textbook, the art of pitching, but he seems to be effective with what he's doing. Ball one. One out, nobody on. Maybe too much break on the slider. Two and one. Big sweeping breaking ball right there. Good pitch. But if he wants to get him to swing at it, he'll have to bring it in a little bit closer to the strike zone. Runs up and gets this one down. And an off-balance throw is in time as he takes one away. Wow. Edmundo Sosa will grab a bat and hit for the pitcher here. Number 53, Edmundo Sosa. 
Utah. And here's a slider that's nowhere close, and it's 1 0. One and zero. Oh, here it is. I don't mind him trying to pitch him backwards right there with those two early count sliders, but now he finds himself in a situation where he's going to have to come fastball. The set and the two and zero. Oh. Had a rip at the two zero oh sinker, but came up empty at strike one. Sosa was born in Panama. He's a second year big leaguer. In there, two and two. Bases are empty here with two men out. Well above the letters with the fastball that time. Well, he really needs to make this guy swing the bat right here. He's not the type of hitter you want to dance around with. And he fouls this one off. He's set the 3 2 down the third baseline. But this will get foul, so they'll do it again. 3 and 2. Ready with the payoff pitch. Now here's a check swing, and they appeal down to first. No swing. So that's ball four. Coming to the plate now, Dexter Fowler. He's got a chance to end this one and send these fans home happy if he can get a ball deep enough into the gap. Here's the first pitch. Low for ball one. Possible winning run stands at first with two out here. This is hit high in the air out toward left center. Enciarte on the run. He gets there to make the catch, and that ends the inning. Tyler Webb takes the mound to start the 11th inning. Number 30, Tyler. 11th inning set to get underway, and into bat next, one of the best run producers in the game, the left-handed hitting first baseman, Freddie Freeman. Now the pitch. Fouled off. Ready with the nothing in one pitch. Ball inside. Ball, that's out. Pitch taken several inches below the zone, in fact. To be honest with you, I'm a little bit more afraid of the guy on deck than the guy that's up right now. If I'm on the mound, I want this guy up right now. He's the guy that's got to beat me. And possibly an interesting development here. It's a leadoff walk to begin the frame in extra innings. The next to bat for Atlanta, Marcelo Zuna. Go ahead run at first. Nobody out. Here's the first pitch. This is hit down the right field line, but it's going to get out of play for strike one. The 0-1. Here's a shot to third, and Carpenter able to take it in. And that's allowed out number one. Now with the play, Travis Darno is one away. The runner at first represents the potential go-ahead score. Double play is in order, however. Here's the first pitch. And a change up here, but that's taken low in the dirt for a ball. And 2 0 as this one's taken low. Clearly working the bottom of the zone, trying to get a ground ball for a double play. Now the 2 0. And he jumps at a change up, a swing and a miss. Possible go ahead runs on first, one away. Maybe lucky to make contact there as this curveball's hit fouled off to the left hand side. Ready with another two strike offering, and it's fouled away. Ready with another two strike offering, heading out towards shallow right. 
there to take it as Fowler as that becomes out number two. Digging in to try it again. Ender Inciarte. He flew out in his last at bat. Here's the first pitch. Two out with the possible go ahead run at first. Swinging a shot back up the middle. And he'll break through with a solid knock here, his first of the ball game. Up next for Atlanta, the third baseman. So Adam. now to the plate, Adam Duvall. Oh, and look at this. High in the air and deep. And when this ball comes down, they'll have taken the lead home run. John Brevia, a six foot one inch right hander, will be the one to get the call from the bullpen here. John Brevia. Dansby Swanson lining up to hit. As the first pitch to him runs a bit inside for ball one. He comes into this appearance in the midst of a one for four day. One and one. Now here's the pitch. Two balls, one strike. Three runs already home here. Three balls and a strike to the Atlanta shortstop. And he misses ball four. So he comes out of the bullpen and immediately walks the first man he faces. A Danny Echevarria will get the call here as he'll hit for the pitcher. it up one and one from the belt kicks and deals two out with the man at first fouled away Change up taken for ball three, well below the zone. Three two, two out, runner on first. Lots of possible outcomes on this pitch. And he strikes him out here for out number three, but the damage has been done as now they'll need some extra. Will Smith gets the call from the pen, and they've saved him for the 11th as he'll try and take this one home. Will. Set now for the bottom of the 11th. And that'll bring up Colton Wong. Hey, not impossible, but highly improbable. Even when you're at home to score three runs off a closer like this guy, they've got the work cut out for him. In tight here with the first pitch fastball that's 1-0. and Ball and a strike. Smith, a native of Georgia. He was selected in the seventh round during the 2008 draft. Man, coming out of the late rounds, you have to grind for everything. Nothing is given to you. And this guy has turned himself into a very solid big league ball player. That's a big accomplishment. The one two. Inside, goal two. Fouls this one off. Another 2 2 offering. Swing and a miss, and that'll get a groan from the home supporters here. One now away. First baseman. Here's Paul Goldschmidt now, struggling so far in this one and looking to erase his 0 for 4 ball game right here. Ready with the first pitch. Here it comes. And he gets ahead here with the fastball. Strike one. High in the air down the right field line. And foul. Here it comes, 0 2. 
Hey, this is a real pesky hitter right here. As a pitcher, you really like to keep this guy off the bases. This is a guy that kind of sets the tables for big innings. Looking for the strikeout. Here's the one two. Hit on the ground out to short. And there are two away now. So Paul DeYoung digs in next. He was retired via the ground ball last time up. Here comes the first pitch. Ball one. Two out, nobody on. That's by him for strike one. It's not easy to get your barrel to a pitch that high. That could be an effective location as long as he keeps it above the letters. Nope. No That's offer on that one. Two balls and a strike. The 2 1 home. Look out for 3 and 1. And this one misses high for ball four, and they have themselves a two out base runner. Now that is Now at the plate, Matt Carpenter. Matt. He went deep back in the fifth. Here's the first pitch to him. Taken, and that one catches the bottom part of the strike zone. Swing and a miss, and he's quickly in the hole 0 and 2. I know this guy has a lot of weapons on the mound, but what makes him so successful is that he's aggressive in the zone, getting ahead, forcing action. And he looks at a ball 1 and 2. Cardinals down to their final strike here. Able to protect the plate with two strikes, and he'll see another one. Again, he sends it out of play. They try to come in with the fastball, but it's too far in, and it's even at two and two. Swing and a miss. He struck him out, and that'll do it here as the ball game is over. Well, they had to put in a couple of extra innings of work, but hey, listen, a win is a win, and any win is good, especially on the road. Five to two, the final today. Darren O'Day is the winning pitcher of record. So that just about does it for Mark DeRosa, Dan Plezak, Heidi Watney, and our entire crew. I'm Matt Vaskersian. You've been watching MLB The Show. For more, make your way over to theshownation.com.